I'm Dean Farr, I'm the Chief Information Officer for the Yuma Elementary School District Number 1. So one of the big reasons we wanted to move in this direction is, is that we had a lot of aging uh, display technology in our classrooms and not all of our classrooms actually had display technology. We continued to receive requests to install uh, interactive displays throughout the district and um, that led to teachers wanting a secondary device to run those interactive displays. As we explored what the solutions were that were out there, we found that interactive display technology had become more affordable and the picture lifespan of the devices were longer. So we invited um, people from across the district to come and demo. So we had teachers and principals and district administration come and watch a demonstration on it and see the technology and see and ask questions about how to use the technology similar to how they were using the current display technology that we have in the classrooms. Uh, I'm Brandon Crisay, the Director of Technology for Yuma Elementary School District Number 1. Uh, we started with new line boards last year with uh, just under 70 in the classrooms. Uh, we tested them out for the year. When we were asked to outfit all of the classrooms, we bought an additional 450, totaling 520 across all District 1 classrooms. Um, when we started this project, uh, we got our field technicians involved to walk every classroom and take a picture of the current uh, audiovisual technology. Um, then we had a team uh, in the technology department go through every picture and identify what needed to happen in every classroom in preparation to install a new board. Uh, once we had a plan for all 450 new rooms um, to get a display, many departments pitched in to help. Uh, we got help from uh, the facilities departments. They did a great job of prepping every room, patching uh, drywall holes, uh, painting um, from old boards coming off the walls. Uh, we enlisted some help from transportation to help us do some demo work to get rid of the old equipment. We had a, uh, a partner vendor uh, out of Phoenix that came in and, and helped us install majority of the boards. We then had uh, 450 new chrome boxes come and we had our help desk um, open every box and enroll them into our uh, enterprise management system one by one. Uh, this all-hands-on-deck approach uh, where everybody helped out uh, enabled us to uh, meet our aggressive timeline. We didn't start until June and we got everything done prior to school starting in August. Hi, my name is Monica Hughes-Gill. I'm a third grade teacher here at Palmcroft Elementary School. Absolutely loving our new line boards and how versatile they are. Um, no matter how your teaching strategies are, it fits in, the new line fits in, kids are more engaged, students can see the boards from pretty much wherever they are in the classroom because of the, um, how bright they are. Kids love using the boards too. And I love being able to be disconnected from my laptop, being able to use my laptop during small group and still have the board going during um, rotations. It's wonderful.